Hello friends, I am Bharat Dwarkani, full stack software developer. In this short video, I will be explaining about the Redis inside. So Redis, as you might be already aware, it is a in-memory data store and usually used in many systems for uh, catching purpose. In this video, I am not going to explain more about Redis, just I am going to explain how to use GUI tool Redis inside by Redis Labs. Many of you might have already used Redis CLI for connecting. So this is just another option for connecting to Redis. So let's uh, get started. Uh, so first you have to go to the redislabs.com site and just uh, download a Redis Insight tool. Once you have downloaded, it will be installed. After installation, just click on the Redis Insight shortcut in the desktop and the web page will be open. I have already actually connected two databases uh, just uh, to get started you can just click on the add redis database icon here you can connect to redis database here you can give your ip address or host url next uh, add the port number which uh, you will be used for connecting to redis then uh, just a name for identification if your redis has username you can just fill on this or otherwise password Next, uh, if you have uh, already enabled TLS or SSL certificate, you can just configure that setting. Once you have clicked, uh, filled all the details, you can just click on Add Redis Database. Then a new item will be appearing here. So if I click on this example, I have already set up uh, connection. So once you open, uh, you will be presented with this screen. So this in the, this is your uh, live data of your uh, Redis instance. Here there are several options available. Uh, on clicking browser, you will get to get to the keys you have used in redis so example if you just click on the key you can get the value of that key so you can just add new key with the uh, various data types you can change the database database also if you are using multiple database next uh, cli here you can just execute your redis command next uh, some more features of redis are also available stream graph gears time series redis search Next, we head over to the analyze section. Here, overview you can just uh, get to know the Redis instance. Here, also, database selection option is present. So, then, key space summary. So, then, any recommendation like example, you can compress your string before storing. So, the, you may see, you can able to save extra 59 KB. Then, the memory analyzer option is available. Here, you can check. Uh, your key how much data it is occupying and uh, what is the length uh, expiry time next uh, is the profiler section uh, you can profile your uh, live memory instance so if you click on profile yes uh, then you can just uh, start and stop profiling you can just get the overview of which command executed and what is the frequency then slow log you can just uh, find which qu uh, redis queries are taking long time so likewise uh, database configuration options are available so this is a short video of explaining how how you can use redis insight tool for connecting to your redis and profiling your redis thank you for watching the video